My name is Alan Bates, and I'm one of the founders of the Justice for Subpostmasters Alliance, which was set up late in 2009 to fight the injustice that post office have put so many subpostmasters through. I was a sub-postmaster in Craigadon, Landidno, from 1998 until late 2003, when post office terminated my contract, giving me three months' notice, without any reason at all. For the first few years, from 2003, I was very much battling post office by myself, and it wasn't until 2008, 2009, when we started to find there were others, and we set up our group. We found then that there were a number of people with convictions, people had lost their homes, families had split up. The devastation and the fallout from what post office did to them, it was, it was horrendous. There was no way you could put this down and walk away from it. It was a far bigger problem than the seem evident to start with. And it wasn't until we actually managed to get them in the courts that we got the truth out of them and that's when it all really started to change. People ask me, is this all over now? You know, have, have you done your work? And I think, almost, we're not quite there yet. My main concern now is obviously finding the financial redress, not compensation, which it's often referred to. It's the financial redress these people are owed that they need sooner rather than later. I think it's it sort of underlines as well that, you know, people with, other pressure groups like that. It is a long haul, and I hope it gives some encouragement to, to those type of groups, that you've got to keep working at it. If you know something's wrong, just keep working at it. I'm sorry I won't be with you tonight. I've been on the inquiry in, in London. There's still work to be done down there, unfortunately. It was a bit of a surprise to hear that the First Minister has recognised me for this award. It means a great deal and I, I'm much appreciative.